Hi, this is Amy from the Alti store. Yes, it's me. I want to show you the kilovolt battery that is cold rated. Now this is the kilovolt CHLX. It is exactly like the HLX uh, batteries that we did a video on already, and you, you can check out the details up here. Um, but it is cold rated. So uh, as you probably know, batteries do not like working in the extreme cold. Lithium and lead acid batteries, both of them don't like freezing weather. So if you've got to have your batteries outside in a cold location that gets below 32 degrees Fahrenheit or zero degrees Celsius, what you can do is get a cold rated battery. Now this will actually heat itself up using the solar power. Here's how it works. So the, the, the power will still be available in the cold weather for uh, discharging, but it will, the BMS will stop the charging capability. And instead, what it will do is if you've got solar panels connected to it through a charge controller, or if you have an AC charger like we've got here, it will redirect any power coming in. And instead of using that to charge it, it will power an internal heating pad. And then once it heats up to 32 degrees, then the BMS will allow the, the power to then go to charging the battery. So what's important to note is it's not going to use the power from the battery itself because you don't want to be wasting any of your stored energy. What it's gonna do is divert any charging energy coming in use that to heat itself up and then allow it to charge. It's a really cool technology. So I thought it would be fun to actually show this working. So what we did was we put an 1800 CHLX in the freezer at work and we got it down to right around uh, six or seven degrees Fahrenheit. Let's plug it in and see what happens. And what happens? It goes way up to its maximum 15 amps, and then it realizes, hey, something's, something's up. Turns itself off, and then it drops down to a lower amperage. So it's down around eight amps. What that eight amps is doing is it's powering the heater. The events log, we see uh, an event that it is in fact warming up the battery. So what temperature are we at? We're at 17.6 degrees. So this might take a little while. Make yourself comfortable and we're gonna keep an eye on this and come back when it's warmer. Okay, just checking in, we are now at 26.6 degrees. So we're getting closer it's 28.4 degrees Fahrenheit. And it actually just turned off the, the charger the, the, um, that powers the heater. But I believe what's happening is it just kind of cycles on and off as needed. So it just cycled off and I think it's gonna to jump back on. Yep, there it is. Jumped right back up. So even after it uh, allows the battery to start charging again, the heater is actually going to stay on until the battery reaches 50 degrees. So again, it just really gives it a little extra heat so that it's not going to just immediately start dropping down and turn off again. So you're not bouncing back and forth. So the speed that this is warming up is, is a little unfair to show because I do have this now in room temperature. So the battery is heating up both from the internal heater and from just the surrounding air. But if this were still in, in the freezing cold uh, outside, if I'm using an AC charger like this, it would take about two hours to heat from minus 22 degrees Fahrenheit up to the 50 degrees Fahrenheit when it turns off. So obviously a little bit less if, uh, if it's not all the way down to 22 degrees. So going from minus four degrees Fahrenheit up to the 50 degree heater shutoff, it's about an hour and a half. You'll notice while it's in this state here, it's actually, it's showing the status of standby. 
So it would be interesting to see what the chat status changes to when, um, when we're charging. 41 degrees Fahrenheit, 5 degrees Celsius has not turned on the charger yet. Okay, so here we go. It got to be 42.8 degrees Fahrenheit or 6 degrees Celsius, and it suddenly, boom, kicked on to the full 15 amps. You can see in the app here, it's doing 14.4 amps. And if we go back to the main page of the app, it shows the status is charging. So look at that. It turned itself off when it got too cold. It used the charging power to heat itself back up. And once it was warm enough that it wasn't going to be turning on and off, it turned itself back into charging mode. Now, a couple things to note about the cold rated ones. What you want to make sure you do is actually put it in a battery box that is big enough that you can put in a layer of rigid foam insulation. So that way, any heat that it does generate while it's charging, it will keep that heat in there. Also important to note that you want to be able to remove that insulation in the hot weather because you don't want the batteries to get too hot. Batteries really like to be right around 25 degrees Celsius or 77 degrees Fahrenheit. That's what they're all rated at. So you want to keep the batteries comfortable. They'll certainly work outside of that range, but you know, you want to set up your battery to be as happy as it can. So anyway, this is the Kilovolt CHLX series. This is Amy from the Alti store. I hope you liked the video. If so, give us a like and a share. And be sure to subscribe so you'll be notified of other videos. And don't forget to go to our website at altstore.com where we've been making renewable doable since 1999.